Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this quick tutorial video I will show you how to use Time Machine on macOS to restore deleted files. So as you can see I have here a few files that I will delete and I will try to restore from my previous backup. So step number one, connect your Time Machine drive. In my case it's a 2TB SSD. So I will select four files and move them to trash. Just like that. Now let's try to empty the trash. So the files are permanently gone from my computer. As you can see, they are no longer there. To be able to restore deleted files, open apps and search for Time Machine. This will open a Time Machine window. You can now literally travel in time and find your previous files. Time Machine Backups is a very cool feature for macOS users. At the bottom part of your screen you see the timeline. So you can find the day when you used to have the file on your computer and restore it from there. In my case January 4. I remember that I used to have files on this date. And I have my files. Magic. <laughs> so it's very very handy. You can really travel in time several months back and find deleted files if you deleted them by accident. Just select them and tap restore four items to your actual location. And wait a few seconds. My files are successfully restored to my computer from my time machine backup. So one important information about Time Machine backups, obviously to be able to restore your files from the past, you need to have Time Machine backups. So think about connecting your Time Machine drive to your computer quite often. You can even go to settings, Time Machine and make sure to manually backup your computer to your Mac. If you want to add automatic backups, Make sure to tap on Options, Backup Frequency Automatically Every Day. You can select Automatically Every Hour or Every Week. I would suggest to keep the Every Day option. Tap on it. Make sure not to select Backup on the battery because Time Machine backups are using a lot of power, so if you want to save your battery life, do not check this option. You can of course perform a manual backup for this, go to the menu bar, click on the Time Machine icon and click on Backup Now. It will force macOS to make a manual backup. You can also browse your Time Machine backups from this window. If you have any questions about macOS Time Machine, please write down in the comment section below. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it useful, please like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.